you're a sugar mama comment below if you are a sugar mama comment below how do you say i hate my family in chinese <laughs> First, we're going to go to breakfast that my brothers keep asking every single day. And then we're going to see a movie. Are we? Yeah, I don't know if you're going. Why not? I want to see that, the color purple. I might. <laughs> I'm going to go back to my room and get something real quick. You can't just leave out of here. Go back to your room. <laughs> <laughs> That's her way of saying she's ready to go. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm just getting something. And I'm coming right back. Well, you can't Yourself. I'm cracking up. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry. No, 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 no. These are Christmas things? Yes. I'm eating breakfast, Wait, you know. I give it a 10 out of 10. Very full, very nourished. Get it. How are you feeling oh after breakfast? Uh, I switched cars to get away from Uh, Made it to wherever we're at. <laughs> How do you say I hate my family in Chinese? <laughs> Just up gang signs. There's Aunt Lou. So far, it was the first night when we were all together and we had so much fun at Zuri's house. Oh, that was amazing to me. Seeing Uncle Joe dance, the crazy dance, and Aunt Marion and us laughing and just, it was just, it felt like a family good time. It was twerking. <laughs> it was twerking. Okay, Hi, vloggers. Like and subscribe. Y'all, I am tired. I'm the one that told everybody to get up so that we could have a day together early. It's everyone's last day, so I said, let's do this early. And I'm tired. But anyways, we're at the VR place right now and we're about to get in there and get lit. I'm on the kids team though. We're against the adults. Smile! Smile! Beat her for the blog. Huh? <laughs> I don't Maya. appreciate that. Maya! Fire! <laughs> what do I got on? Fire. The games will three. now begin. Because you're three. Red light, green light. Sorry. That's my. Red light. Green light. Red light. Green light. What? I was like, I just got it. Oh, alright, watch this. Oh. Three seconds remain. <laughs> 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 Let's get it. Zaya, <laughs> go. Go, Javon. Go. 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 And match. Whoa. Congratulations, you are the winner. Okay, so, we just got out of the movie. And now, uh, my cousins are in the store taking photos. And here's Cyan. She's taking photos of my other cousin, Maya. She's recorded a lot. Like and subscribe and hit that little bell. Y'all, I'm so tired. We're at this mall and there's an actual Fashion Nova store. 
I thought Fashion Nova was online only, but it's a whole store here. Your social battery ever just die and you don't see it coming? I've been in a two hour movie, so I didn't think my social battery would be dead, but apparently it was dying in there. The color purple was amazing. I am very, very, very impressed by Fantasia. And also the woman that played Oprah, Oprah's part with Harpo, good, but I, I forgot that it was a musical. It's like a throwback, like back in the day when Tyler Perry used to have his plays and then they just bust out singing and you're like, whoa. I had a couple of those moments, but nonetheless, good movie. Um, everybody leaves today. I'm over here with all of us. Yeah. Not now. <laughs> Fine. My family is summoning me by y'all. <sighs> Good morning, y'all. It is 5.52. Your girl is about to go back to sleep. But um, everybody's leaving. They're tapping on the door saying bye. I can hear them shuffling down the hallway to leave to go to the airport. And I'm like, I've really been enjoying my time in Cali. Like my whole family was here. It's crazy. I just love when we all get together. It was really, really fun. I'm so happy and grateful that this happened. And my friend Daryl, he comes into town. Oh my God, really quick, let me tell y'all about Daryl. Daryl and I met in college. Have you ever had somebody where when you talk to them, you're just rolling, you're laughing? <laughs> <laughs> you're shout the season, you <laughs> You're like, okay, you gotta go home because my stomach hurts. That is Daryl. Three hours later. I don't know what it is. Do you ever have that sensation where you set your alarm and you just keep waking up, looking at your phone, making sure your alarm didn't go off or something or that you didn't set it or something? That's how I've been feeling. I kept waking up, looking at my alarm and I still have to pack and it's just like, Oh my God, wow. I am really envious of people that know how to pack. Ever since I was younger, my mom is one of those people that packs so big. When you pick up her suitcase to put in the car, you grunt. Like, huh. Huh. you could be going somewhere for three days. I bet you she gonna have eight outfit. And it's like, I can't knock her because I've been in an instance where I'm like, you don't need to bring all that. And then I fell in some mud and my whole outfit was ruined. And I was so happy that she had an extra outfit. Ever since then, I've been like, okay, you need extra. You can't just have enough. But it's like, what is the balance between having enough and having a little extra? Because there's nothing worse than everybody saying, hey, let's go out to the club. And you're like, wow, I've only brought enough for athleisure and, you know, regular day activities. Or for somebody to say, hey, let's go hiking. And you're like, wow, I only brought and you need like some tennis shoes. You know what I'm saying? Like. Come on now, you need stuff for the club, you need stuff for doing activities, you need stuff for regular schmegular days, you need stuff to look cute. And don't get me started on being a content creator. Hood. If you're trying to take pictures at different landmarks and locations, you want different outfits. Stop it, get some help. Now that might sound vain, it does. Hey, I hate that for me, but it just is what it is. I'm procrastinating packing while telling y'all about my hate for packing because I just have not figured it out yet at the ripe age of 20. Loser! And if you have any tips, genuinely, please comment down below. Do y'all be liking these vlogs? I am actually really getting into vlogging. Something about connecting with y'all that I love. So tell me, what type of vlogs do you all like? Cause I might double and dabble a little bit. I'm trying to make it make sense on my channel so that y'all aren't like, whoa, we might get a cooking lesson here. We might get it do, 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 here. We might, you know, but I also want to make it authentic. I'm not one of those fakers. I'm not finna be forcing myself to always go to these places just to look like I go to these places. Baby, I go to these places and it be lit, but it don't be every day. <laughs> it's not every day, okay? I'm a boss. It's not giving sugar daddy, wish it was you're a sugar mama comment below what other things what low maintenance vlogs could i do when i get in town 
I'm traveling all the time, so you'll always have trouble. But on the days that I'm in town and it's just a regular regular day, do y'all want to ride around with me to Starbucks? Or would y'all like to see me do something in the house? Like, what is the vibe? Let me know because I am really liking vlogging. Hmm. But yeah, I guess I've procrastinated enough. Waking up to this view, I will not forget. I especially love this side, but I don't know. The mountains are beautiful too. Everywhere here looks like a postcard. Let's try on some clothes. Okay, so I got two outfits from Fashion Nova. Before I check out the hotel, I wanna see what the vibes are because I need to know if I'm going shopping for New Year's or if I found something. So, two options. Y'all be the judge. I don't know. I kind of feel like a boss ass Power Ranger. What do y'all think? What is, I should have put y'all up here. I'm just gonna show in the mirror. This is it. Excuse the dirty room. It's not zipped all the way because I don't have time for all of that. But this is the vibe. Kind of feel like a little Power Ranger. But it's sexy, you know? It accentuates the body. Okay, one more. Holding the back end right here. So ignore that because we don't have time to, um, you know, take it out. But this is the vibe of the second outfit. I kind of like this. This screen is more New Year. It's like, pow! I have a ride with some fire makeup. Uh huh. This is the look. <sighs> I loved this hotel. It definitely had the vibes, and I need some lip gloss, baby. But they told us to be downstairs at 11:30, and guess what time it is? 11:29. If it's one thing about Cyan, she gonna always be on time. Ooh, did you like the way that rhymed? Ah! Let me stop. Good morning. I love hammocks. Something tells me I'm gonna go to sleep out here one of these days so relaxing seeing the people drive by on the hill too relaxing you can even hear the birds they they done had like three song selections by now but this is a radio station i would never want to change finished look. I am waiting for Zuri and then we finna go to Beverly Hills. My snipers hit their marks and your guards fall down from a rifle to the heart like clap, clap, let them fall slow. I know you had your fears, you can let them all I'm trying to get video for your vlog. So I act accordingly, but this is so refreshing. There's Lolita and my foot looking like somebody's grandma. I'll provide protection if you open up the door for me. A couple stairs, couple texts, couple dates, couple I think that we're ready. Couple I think we should wait. Are we acting like a couple? I'm just trying to get it straight. Cause I'm over here convinced that it's too early for mistakes and then. First of all, how cute is this little place? I'm gonna show y'all. There's this uh restaurant called the Hideaway and it's literally hidden. It's so cute on Rodeo.
said that all the magic go I followed the rules and told you everything you had to know Had you over every night, every night was passionate Plus you met my mother even if it was an accident I'm confused, tell me where we go wrong I was sure that I I want to show y'all how bad the hills are in Holly, the Hollywood Hills are, what they have to drive and endure. Cause to me, it's so crazy. The, the lanes are so small that the cars have to go beside each other to go, but you have to go so fast down. Oh nah, I just heard something crinkle in the, uh, in the grass. They got coyotes down here. I've seen four coyotes and it's a very dog friendly place. So there's animals everywhere and I'm like, how do you protect your animals? But okay, back to this road. Let me show y'all really quick. Okay, this part isn't super duper uber bad, right? But keep in mind that two uh, cars have to fit on this road. So right now it's cool because it's super early, right? But in the evening, baby, this, you would not think that this is no damn street. It's a hill. Like a little mini hill, right? You would never think to turn on that. But you have to turn on it. It's crazy. But I'm on the way to go pick up my girl Chantal. I'm so excited. We're about to take over LA, baby. So I'm gonna put the camera down because I'm not playing when I say that um, driving out here, there, there's no dri drinking and driving. There's no texting and driving like in the hills. Once you get down to flat land, then you're cool. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go until I can come back. <laughs> I want that pussy in the red. If I said I'm in love. Every eyeball that look at me, she wanna kill me. Yeah, stupid how you get the college, the college. Now, why would you pull up this close to this car? You have all this space, sir. Why are you here? Strip a booty in a rack like, wow. 